Special thanks to Thingy, the Temporal Discussion Podcast, Lemon314, Lord Entropy, Avalie Long, JL, Laszlo Panaflex, Metric Conversion, Nubix Cube, Val Sharan, A, Bender Waffles, Freak, Shuin 3D Blast, Shine Wolf, Ryan Devil23, Ministry of On We Control, Miku, Zeech, and Grizzly Old B for sponsoring my videos on the Ramp Project. Go to David X Newton on Patreon to join the ASCII Brigade. You know, no matter how much I play of this, there always seems to be a lot more left. However, uh, let's go and pay a debt to the Deathless uh, by Jedi MB. This is in the Accursed Ruins again. Looks like the ruins, the town, and the starbase are the ones we've done the least of. But uh, really, it's, it's not much between them anymore. Oh. Press jump, or all of those to skip narration. Two days ago... You returned home from the clinic to find a small package outside your door. Enclosed was a peculiar deep red crystalline key. The key was wrapped up in a note covered in barely decipherable scribbles and stained with dirt and blood. For the more coherent bits, the handwriting was clearly your mother's. Well, it can't be my mother's handwriting if it's coherent. I've never been able to read it. You hadn't had much contact with your mother in recent years and assumed that she resented you. But you had heard from your sister that she was recently flown out by the Union Aerospace Corporation to assist with an archaeological dig site they had secured the rights to. Against your better judgment... You bought a ticket for the first plane to e Egypt and rented a car to take you out to the site. The camp was lifeless and empty, but at the centre of it was the opening to a subterranean structure with a rope tied to a heavy rock as the only obvious way down. Oh, here we This is interesting. Um, are we in for another really spooky one? We'll see. Your key unlocked the chest. Okay. It's that hex and two texture again. Oh, you pressed your hand against the bloody handprint. Just like you uh, worked out to, how to do that after four months in hex and two and something stirs within the wall. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, okay. You've got a bad feeling about this, Indiana Jones. Oh, no, that wasn't Indiana Jones. That was Han Solo. Are you ready to die? <laughs> Run! Wow, that's some knife. It's odd, but I'm uh, a lot more, uh, I'm a, a lot less unsettled by that demon's appearance now that I know he can speak English. All right, we're. Oh, okay. Crawl through there. Got uh, a, an eternal lotus. You know what? This is a really good weapon. Uh, those were UAC soldiers, no doubt about it, but they were changed somehow. And in front of you, yes indeed. Hmm. Oh, that's back here, okay. Maybe the route will take later on. Let's head over here. Oof! Oh, hello. Uh, with only five days remaining until deadline, an unproductive week and change of... Oh, oh no! Pericoronitis... Pericoronitis behind me. It is time to accept not standing a snowball's chance in heck of finishing even a fraction of what I've been planning and setting up. It's been a nice opportunity to learn Z-Script and various other neat little G's I Doom features I hadn't explored before, and I've also greatly enjoyed the chance to help others in the ramp community. Both new faces and ones I've had the pleasure of chatting with for the past two years or so, I wanted a moody and elaborate Metroid or Zelda-like map with keys and chests, portal puzzles, and just what would hopefully be a cool secret ending, but instead, just pull this lever. <laughs> well... 
Oh, you. <sighs> Why didn't I see that coming? I will say, though, that that's, um, that's exactly what I want people to do in Ramp, to just experiment with new things, uh, to try out in a Z script, and uh, I really thank you for helping other people out in the chat as well. And uh, I hope that's given you a great basis to work from, uh, to maybe make this a reality later on. Like I've said a few times uh, this year, in this uh, incredibly long run of videos, uh, I never really intended Ramp to be for a really elaborate long project. I'm very pleased and flattered that people submit them, but you don't have to complete a huge masterpiece for Ramp. It's, it's about just getting the idea off the ground, getting a prototype running. Something did open, but not sufficiently. There we go. What happened to the music? Where am I? What's happening? There we go. That definitely moved. I just want to see if that, uh, Open something I can re trigger. Yes. Oh, hang on, you changed the message as well. It's a, got a box of Walker's Pure Butter Shortbread? Question mark. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't actually a red key. Hell. Anyone else? Oh, there you go. Can I just, oh, I can just lumberjack my way through these vines. Uh, I said in a, a few maps ago, you know, like 150 or so, that's, uh, <laughs> that's uh, what I really wanted to be able to do with the chainsaw. Right, we got a pack of custard cream biscuits, question mark. So, we need this Scottish blend tea to complete the trifecta. Um, this way then? Ah. Ah. Aha, okay. Oh! Oh, what now then? That's definitely an overgrown switch. There's evidence of a secret here, but I can't uh, open it. Where do I go now? Oh, there's a... Something there as well. Uh, 
I'm not skinny enough to, to fit through there. And that doesn't appear to be... Oh, do I need to change all that first? The vines are too tough for the knife. There we go, okay. We've got it. Bit secrety. Another skeleton key. Got quite a lot of those by now. So what do I do now? Back here? Can I change my way through the uh, boot now? I can! Aha, uh -huh, that's an interesting new mechanic. And now I can get the... Uh, the uh, what was it? Scottish Blend. Okay. And now there's the uh, big monster through there. Well, I can't get through there, though. And I don't think this chainsaw is going to do it. Read that. Oh, I knocked the lamp around. So where now? Oh, I can extinguish the torches. Don't know why I would want to, apart from this one. The gentle flame seeps into your soul and whispers, Find Lydia's Cistern 3 and you'll be rewarded. Violet awaits you where worlds connect. Curiouser and curiouser. Well, if I go back this way then. Back full of ammo. What I'd really like, though, is uh, somewhere to use these uh, items I've been gathering. I've got two skeleton keys. I thought I had three, but perhaps I miscounted. not uh, crouch when you're on the map. Aha! Violet creature with glee. You're well on your way. To find lavender, you must retrace your steps. All right, that's opened this somehow. I'm not exactly sure which uh, combination of picking up things did it. <coughs> oh, is this our boss encounter? Yes, it is. Oh. Oh, that's a great effect. Are you ready to die? Oh, good a helmet. Ow. I need loads more rockets, please. Thanks. This is a boss. This is uh, much more interesting than you know than having a cyber demon. And Doom doesn't really have these uh, 
monsters that have multi-projectile attacks. Uh, I really do need loads more rockets, please. There's one. Here's another. Oh! Exactly what I needed, thank you. Is, uh, is that us now? That is us. That's the end. And that is... A really excellent little adventure map. I don't think that the warning in the middle was uh, needed whatsoever, although I'm uh, glad that uh, you recovered, and I'm glad that you had a good time anyway. Uh, so yeah, hopefully that can be repeated and expanded on and uh, released sometime later. That was really great. Now we are going for some Mecha Mutant Mayhem. That's Town by Linus. Okay, HQ default, that is in the town square as well. Right at the back here. <laughs> All right. Don't forget to reload. Ow. Oh, okay. Dear FBI, there is nothing suspicious happening in here. Please go away. Heart UAC. Hmm, all right. Never mind then. Oh, look at that! I really like... Th th sketch this. Uh, somebody sketched this in the uh, channel and it's appearing all over. And I, I really appreciate these uh, little... Uh... Whoa! How dare you. This looks better. At first I hated uh, putting reloading in Doom. I thought it just gave Doom the problems of uh, more modern day shooters. Whoop. But then I kind of appreciated it for how vulnerable it made you. It's it's the same as changing weapons. And you have to strategize around that. Greater city atmosphere here as well. I, I love those um, beams there and, and how they affect the light. That's great. Right, looks like those uh, grey doors aren't uh, going to be openable. That's a good uh, visual cue to learn. Uh, just looked a bit openable, that's all, with the uh, strut there. Right, I need to be using more cover is uh, what I'm uh, getting from this. It's a bit of a Metal Gear Solid kind of rhythm to this music. Let's go! Oh. Let's go! Oh. Get some. 
Oh, here's your experiment. I can't move behind me. Okay, I was lucky to survive that. Yeah, that uh, shot behind me when I came in. Oh, sorry, out of ammo. Here we go. Right. Blue door, do I have any more ammunition to scavenge just while I'm here? Uh, maybe a bit. Can't grab the uh, blue armor. Probably stared right at the secret once or twice. Where are the sound effects from, by the way? It's unfortunate that uh, Doom's enemy AI isn't quite as applicable to humans as it is to zombie creatures from another dimension. Oh, there's another rapid fire uh, enemy just around the corner here. Oh, there he is. This is reminding me that for uh, Nanu Wardmo some year, I want to uh, try to translate the uh, Secret Agent style gameplay, you know, Apogee Secret Agent into a Doom format. But I think the uh, the gameplay of Doom might make it lose its comedic edge. There we go. That's a shame. I have to find another way round. Oh, here come the revenants. So that pack's a bit more punch than I expected. Ow! Well, I'm keen on getting that uh, exploding shotgun. Ow! So even the. Uh, Weaker enemies are pack quite a lot of punch if you don't know what you're doing. Okay, here we go. Night what? Yeah, just moving the enemies slightly lower gives them quite a lot of cover.
Okay. Aha! Okay. What does this say? I, I was curious about this sign. Very illegal mutation labs. Horns for added danger. Ah, if you leak this, we will kill you. Well, that's nice and clear. So I wondered if uh, this combination lock would... Uh, Yeah, I thought it might, uh, unlock- oh, it did. Uh, hang on a minute. Okay, that is unlocked, okay. I wondered if an alternative combination would open uh, one of the secrets. But in my fumbling finding, I, I, I didn't uh, find it. I've heard that before. Uh, <laughs> ah, BFEB 9000. <laughs> Haven't seen one of those before. Ah, now here's the way up, okay. Oh, you've now access the lift to return to the cell. Well, yeah, I was thinking that that might be. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Hang on. I was thinking that uh, activating that lift might be on the cards, and that's a nice way of letting the player return to somewhere that they've already, you know, earned. They've already achieved the route up to here, then they shouldn't have to go through the entire map again to get here. Are these like a uh, sandbags here? That's an interesting little uh, use of uh, the Doom resources. I've been here for about ten minutes now, haven't I? Yeah, but I've only got forty-four enemies left. Let's see if we can speed through it. Okay, so I think I might not want to stray over here too long. Right, what I was trying to uh, express there in the heat of gunfire was that if I go over to the other side of there too early, going to be hit with this encounter here, which opens up when you wander over towards the other side. Oh, come on! It's that reload that gets you. Oh, also the fireballs. It's a selection of weapons you've added uh, to the project as well. Uh, 
they take a bit of getting used to when you're used to the Doom weapons. I appreciate the punchiness of this shotgun. A bit faster than the super shotgun. Not quite as uh, rockety in terms of damage. But it's definitely uh, more than adequate. Alright then. Here, Xville is nearby. Be extract. Uh, X Traction zone is hot. That the uh, radio is acting up a bit, but watch your language. And that is our extraction zone. Extraction zone. Extra extraction zone. Where I pick up the extraction phone to get an extraction helicopter. Uh, yeah, that was a really nice alternative take on Doom. You know, you, is it Doom anymore? You use the Doom engine, you stuff it with uh, custom monsters and weapons, and you can make something completely different. And uh, it's quite nice that uh, the uh, compiler for Ramp can handle these things now. All right. 038 is Exit the Gecko, another prototype edition that's uh, possibly uh, going to be cut short, but uh, we're going to the Accursed Ruins again. Oh, now this reminds me of um, the Bermondoon map. What was it called? But It was in an alien uh, sack. Yeah, exactly like these. Here we go, then. Oh, I think, uh, were you the one experimenting with uh, AI textures as well, to make uh, Geiger-esque textures? Hmm. I think I've upset its stomach. <laughs> oh, it says unknown script. See, is, is that, um, is that going to be a problem? We'll see. 49 puzzles left to pop. Forty-eight puzzles to pop on the wall. Da, 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 da. Um oh, those uh, blind pinkies. It's a creepy the way they wander, isn't it? And I know what the unknown script zero is, it's because um, when you modify a load of lines on the map and you... Uh, I usually find it when you toggle the map flags, uh, then there are script assignments. If you use uh, named scripts, then they tend to disappear and become zero instead. Um, perhaps I shouldn't be... Perhaps I shouldn't be uh, activating these. We knew that was going to happen, of course, but uh, it was a nice way of not making the one with the super shotgun on it overly suspicious. <laughs> I'm not getting through these. I'm a master of pustule popper. Right, I'll pop you with my fist. What is this rubbish fist uh, damages I'm getting? Ow. 
Thanks. All pastures gone. All right, I think I've cleared out back here. <laughs> you ain't gonna let me get away with that. I hear the sighted pinkies, which might be worse than the blind ones. Uh, let's get some shells first. All right. Uh, let me come back and get that when I need it. The ones with their eyes just have such amazingly creepy faces. Yeah, okay. Don't feel like dealing with that. Let's just have some invulnerability. Oh, hello there. Fancy beating you here. A lot of the, um, the sort of big projects are in this block. I remember Exit the Gecko and uh, the Indiana Jones one, and uh, one that's coming up, uh, taking a long time to, to uh, construct. There's a, whoa, a mega sphere. Yeah, not time for that yet. Chainsaw Gary. Don't know what I'm saying. Find our way through that. Another supercharge, which is very generous. One might almost say suspiciously so. Too much in the way of the arch file there, but uh, not unsurvivable. Okay. I like the use of fog here as well, the just on the inner sectors to give these uh, vertical lines. All right, uh, 16 enemies to go, one megasphere to take. Hello. Oh, you're new. You jumpy bastard. Weren't you in the haunted mansion? Hello again. Coming into me. Down in the mosh pit. The imps didn't uh, get involved. They just weren't feeling it today. All right.
Whoa! Beam us up, Scotty! Whoa! I'm, it's a bit difficult to uh, control where you're going on those. Hang on, here we go. Whoa, there we go. All right! Is that the end? Not quite. Oh, that's a nice snakeskin texture. I don't seem to be getting anywhere. It's like exiting the gecko. Hmm. Looks like exiting the gecko will not be as uh, easy as I thought. Wait a minute. What am I waiting for? All oh, right, there seems to be no more map left, for now at least. So sorry for the inconvenience. Look, I'll tell you what, I'm going to keep on working on this map for a few more weeks, and you will get to see some lizards in the meantime. Lizards on the fridge. Are you ready? Go! Whoa! Look at this lizard! Look at that lizard! And that one! That's a nice lizard! Wait a minute, are you frozen in carbonite or something? Uh, that's... Uh, that's an abstract lizard. And there's a nice lizard. And that's a cute lizard. Uh, that's kind of a scary lizard. And that's a lovely lizard. That's, uh... Unsettlingly anthropomorphic lizard. That was a nice lizard. Just, he's doing his job keeping the fridge closed. And uh, he's, he's just raiding the salad drawer. How lovely. Uh, masterclass in AI art. Again, a really uh, nice, slightly different theme, uh, sort of a living womb level. And I think that worked really well with those uh, new textures and the uh, slightly scarier enemies than normal. Necrosis by Lord Entropy is next, and it's in the Starbase. Uh, this is another thing that was uh, meant to be a much more ambitious project, but uh, then was sensibly scaled back a bit. Uh, because, well, first of all, just look at it. This is a sequel to my Route 2021 map, Neoplasm. In the Route version of this map, the red route is complete and fully playable. The final map will also contain yellow and blue routes. And we'll resolve the story from Neoplasm. Look at that. This is another uh, mapper who chose to just go absolutely mental with the details. And uh, Lord Entropy's maps are, are just so distinctive as a result. The thing I still remember from Ramp 2021 that you put this domed building in it. And all the circles, very uh, into circles. the other end of the circle by now? Or am I just uh, paranoid after that last uh, experience with circles? No, no, the, the, there are definitely uh, more than one layer of circles happening here. Yeah, so here... We'll go around the circle once. Okay, we're at blue. Go around the circle another time. We're somewhere completely different. 
when we go around the circle. <laughs> okay. And then we're back at the start. Wow! Oh, I'm floating. All right then. That's amazing! This is a, I think this is a 3D model, isn't it? I could be wrong, but this was a geometry that was made in UDB and was uh, exported as a 3D model and then uh, brought back into the map as a 3D model. Which is something I've never tried before, but uh, which, uh, well, just look at the results. Uh, prog time change just happened in the music. Ah, I got it. were really closely guarded secrets in games and it was amazing what you could find that was hidden in your game. You couldn't just go onto the internet and find it. You had to be told by uh, rumours from a friend or a game magazine or a cybernetically enhanced Patrick Moore. Sorry about the noises from uh, Chrome. I forget I'll leave these notifications on. That's my workmate who's probably captured yet another of my pieces in chess or put me in a three-way fork. I'm getting better though, the score! The score is now one games to 14, I think. I always felt I should be better at chess than I actually am. Oh, I love these arches and the glowing pillars and everything. It's spectacular. And the MIDI's doing something uh, that makes it sound a lot fuller as well. The um, trick of echoing one guitar part in, in the other ear. There's a lot of imps here. There's a lot of everything here, really. Okay, I think that's sorted them all out. Just these spiders to go. Oh, there's another imp. And evidently, a one to my right that I didn't see. Where are they all coming from? Okay. Oh, that, and another mancubus. It's 
Sunset. Beautiful building. So how do I get that soul sphere? Ah, ha ha ha! I think I've discovered something. There we go. It's very rewarding. Okay, let's do the same on the other side. Okay, what did that do? Oh, okay, it's a bit uh, different this side. That's really good. I was, uh, wasn't exactly worried that it was going to be just symmetrical, but uh, symmetrical would have been a bit boring there. Okay, where's our next big fight? I'm glad that our Scala friends are just catching themselves on the door. Where are you? Did I get him? from this one. Excuse me while I run away. <laughs> Get lost. Just been lucky this time uh, being able to find these little windows to dodge through. Well, what about luck last? Congregated a bit through there. I need more rockets. I'm not uh, chain gunning these ones. It's weird when you hear the doom rocket sound in, in a transition. And I, I swear it's in uh, Winnie the Pooh of uh, that uh, Penny watches. The 3D animated one. The the scene transition uses the Doom rocket sound. All right. Did I switch anything or uh, achieve anything here? I want to make sure that I actually pressed everything I was meant to. It's a challenge within a challenge, having that uh, tight corridor and followed by the open arena. Optionally with... Oh, hello! Optionally with other uh, problems coming uh, from within the tight corridors again. That didn't turn out to be much of a problem. How long have I been going? Probably about 45 minutes. Uh, 11 minutes. We've got 26 enemies to go. Do you think we can justifiably finish this one? Oh, 
Uh, I might die actually instead. Ah! What an unfortunate uh, place to be rocketed. It's been a pause when this one reloads. Saved in the bad place where, during the load, they're going to get a chance to have a free shot on me. Ah. Okay, it's time to probably admit defeat on this one. And just say that uh, it's a very beautiful map. If I had uh, five more minutes probably complete this, but for the sake of equity, I think it's time to move on. Absolutely beautiful maps, by the way. Not just that one, which was uh, incredibly elaborate, but uh, just the decoration that people are putting in the maps in all styles. You're far surpassing me. Uh, let's go to the Infernal Castle this time and play Exaltation by the Viper Killer. Yeah, I finally think that joke's run its course. <laughs> Oh, that looks interesting. The Necromancer's Demise by James Paddock. Hello! Aha! Is there anything going on here? Hmm. Let's go then. Let's go, then. Oh, you're new. Little, uh, wobbly arachnorbs. to be a decent amount of infighting going on already. All right, let's uh, get up here then. Whoops, hello. Annoyed something over there. Ow, 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 ow. Ow! I'm supposed to drop all the way back down here and just gather up all these health packs. Look at the sine wave of uh, plasma there. That's a tricky enemy with its uh, extremely rapid fire. It looks more rapid than the Arachnatron. I pressed that switch, but uh, I didn't see what it did. Just 
just waiting for it to cross the road. Aha! Uh -huh. going on here? Question mark, question mark. Right there. Thanks for your assistance. That took a while. Oh no. I was almost experiencing a bit of empathy for that spider coming out of its nest and then uh, experiencing stun lock and just dying instantly. But then that lock came in and uh, put me back in a demon killing mood. Ooh, what are you? Doom Sphere. What's that do? And a supercharge. I'm all kind of charged up. But for what? <laughs> well, that was nice while it lasted. I'm going to uh, reload that and... Uh, we'll see what that does after I've uh, found a path out of here. Yeah, we know here. And this route opened up... ...after I came through. That's back to here. Oh, right. So we'll take the shells, take the supercharge, and we'll... Was that it? No, it wasn't. Here we go. I 
I think it's enhancing my damage. Oh, I'm not sure about that, actually. Yeah, maybe. A bit twitchy there and just missed completely. the red uh, sticky toffee pudding, but not the way to get to it. Obviously. Oh, hello. Now, I'm imagining that I could have done this uh, side quest before the other one, or it might have it might have only opened up after I did the caves. I don't know. Just looked to, like to me that there were two exits from that arena in the center. There's another instance where I'm uh, just gathering up a big ball of pain for later. It seems to have uh, smashed itself on the pillar somewhere. So I'm fine. Right, let's uh, poke the nose of this miserable looking gargoyle. A bit of satisfaction. Hello. Wasn't watching my back. More monsters there are, okay. And an, uh, 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 sorry, I was about to call you an Arachnotron, but you're not. Okay. Oh dear. Oh, you're new. the blue attack that they do. Oh, players have a psychic trauma from a Ragnorb Queen's brainwaves. Oh, can they project themselves towards you, is that it? All right, that's been our 10 minutes for this map. Again, I've come uh, frustratingly close to getting to the end. But this has been a set of challenges that's been, you know, hard, but not overwhelming. Felt satisfaction from getting through them, and I love the use of the new enemies as well. I think the uh, Arachnorbs and uh, 
these ugly creatures are definitely adding a new uh, challenge to them. Alright, I suppose I've got to clear this up lot up now. I'll see you later. <laughs>